Hello guys and uh, welcome to Tech Design. Please uh, subscribe to my channel and uh, hit a like button as well as share my videos. Uh, so in this video, I will be showing you how we can make this uh, 3D model. So this is also very simple. So previously, I have already uh, made two 3D examples. You can check it out in my uh, channel playlist so that uh, you can understand the how we can able to proceed. So now what I will do is I will just uh, create this so what i will do is i'll just create this uh, model so let's uh, go into the annex and let's click ok so now we will start a new file model hit ok <clears throat> so this is uh, now uh, in uh, after doing all 3d uh, commands i will be just explaining around the 20 uh, example so that it will be easy for you to practice um, so uh, meanwhile I will be uploading some other I will just take up uh, some other module uh, like assembly module otherwise uh, surface modeling so uh, let's decide later so first what I will do is I will just uh, make a use of this 32 and 56 as well as 8 and also if you want you can make this uh, Cut out as well in the first sketch itself if you do that it will be easy for you uh, so that the the more feature the more steps will be reduced so what i will do is i will just make 32 and uh, 56 uh, rectangle initially so let's go into the sketcher environment and uh, just play and click ok so we'll have this and now what I'll do is I'll just uh, switch up the continuous side to dimension and let's click okay let's create a rectangle so 32 and 56 so let's go to dimension and uh, click this is 32 and uh, one more is 56 okay now what i will do is i will just uh, make symmetric so this two lines should be symmetric to this and now click reset otherwise this center line it will take the default so select these two and make this a symmetry so now your uh, sketch is completely constrained let's click finish either you can do it uh, by doing just a sketch of this one and extrude it and then later you can uh, make these cutout and as well as these extrudes so what i will do is i will just uh, make it simple so i'll go inside this and uh, let's make one more uh, rectangle inside this as this cutout so 20 16 and this is 12 so let's make it as 20 from this to this it is 20 and next we have 16 so length of this rectangle is 16 okay now it is 12 let's make this And then from one edge it is 10. So let's make from this edge to this edge it is 10. Okay, now you can see this the uh, sketch is fully constrained and we have got almost uh, sketch is almost, almost completed. Let's finish the sketch. And now what I will do is you can see here it is 8 mm. 8 mm uh, extrude is there so let's make the uh, 8 mm extrude so the single curve is there i will just make it auto feature curve so that it entirely selects the sketch uh, once i give that 8 mm is our extrude length so let's give it and keep it as none 
perfect okay so the base is ready now as you can now what we will do is uh, we will uh, uh, two extrudes so you can see here 16 mm and 8 mm is the rectangle and 20 mm is the extrude length so what i will do is i will just create uh, one more sketch on this plane so let's select the plane and uh, now what i will do is i will just create one more rectangle here as well as rectangle here so those two rectangles with a dimension of 16 and 8 so let's give 16 and 8 so this is 8 and this is 16 Similarly, this is also 8 and this is 16. Oh, so once this is done, you can directly uh, make a rectangle from this edge or else uh, I will just create this in order to show you how we can constrain it. So just click C and point to point and this point should be located on this. So it will be in this proper position and this point will be on this point so you can see here these two rectangles are ready just click finish and uh, let's extrude this up to 20 mm so i think uh, it is from 20 mm from this base so we have to give 20 minus 8 because 8 mm extrude is already done so let's give 20 minus 8 so i'll just select the feature curve this is uh, 20 minus 8 so just unite this with the body and click ok now as you can see here uh, this uh, model is uh, ready according to the given uh, 2d drawing so this is my third uh, uh, model 3d model please subscribe to my channel so that i will uh, updating you on different, different uh, examples as well as once the exams are, uh, examples are finished, uh, we'll be moving to uh, surface modeling or else uh, assembly module. So thank you guys. Thank you very much.